Hey, it's Brian. I'm here with your Midnight Mechanic tech tip for today. When you're working on a project, the most important thing you need to know is how to put it back together when you're done. The easiest way to do this is to take pictures. Now everyone here has a digital camera or a cell phone or a GoPro or some way to take pictures. The easiest way to know what you're doing is to take pictures of everything before you get started. That way, when you go to put everything back together, you know exactly what you're looking at. But people nowadays have a big advantage over people that used to work on the cars back in the day. Nowadays you have the internet, you have digital cameras, cell phones, things that can take pictures and document better. They didn't have that back then, so you just had to really pay attention, write down what you were doing, and hopefully you could get it back together right. Now, if you mess up things, then you can always look on the internet, look on YouTube, things like that, and figure out exactly what you're doing. So documenting your work with pictures is very important because even if you know how things go back together, sometimes things happen that mess you up to the point where you don't know how to put it back together. So you could get halfway through a project and then all of a sudden you get sidetracked, you have to go this, um, you knock something over, or you end up with a situation like us where I had this transmission, I took it completely apart, I knew how to put it back together and I had it laid all out nicely on the workbench, but something from our attic fell down, landed on a workbench and scattered everything everywhere. So rather than just being able to put this thing back together because we had it all laid out nicely, I had forgotten to take pictures. So now all of a sudden, rather than just flipping through my pictures, saying this goes here, this goes here. Now all of a sudden I got to look on YouTube, I got to look on the internet and I got to find pictures and I got to figure out exactly how this goes back together. Now, if I had pictures, it would have been simple, but instead now all of a sudden I got an extra hour of time, something like that, just to figure out how to get this transmission back together again. So I'll go ahead and apologize because that transmission I was talking about that got scattered everywhere, well, that was the one from our breakage versus carnage video where I said we were going to rebuild it and show you how to do it. Well, it wouldn't make a good video now, so we'll have to find another transmission to do that. We will do it, but just not with that transmission, and it'll probably take a little bit longer. So hopefully you learn from that and you see taking videos, taking pictures, that's the best way to do it and best way to know how things go back together. So that's your Midnight Mechanic tech tip for today. Join us next time for more tech tips and hopefully you learn from our mistakes. Thanks.